Welcome to episode 1. I am going to junk journal today. If you're not familiar with this term, it simply means creating some funky, eclectic art books and journals out of nothing. Junk bits and pieces that you love and collected, your memorabilia, ephemera pieces. I made this cover out of scraps of material. I'm not sure exactly how it's going to work out yet. It's kind of a work in progress. This is my final layout and pages for the next project. And I might put these cool applique, I think they're called, in the back. I'm stitching just simple, these are actually paper bags from groceries and I was pleasantly surprised um, how well they worked. I really enjoyed working with them. What is interesting to me is that I've been collecting ephemera long before I heard of junk journaling. So, of course, I put junk journaling on my famous list of projects that I must try. A lot of these pieces I keep have stories, like these two cards. One on the left I put twice out of a stack of cards my friend Diana gives away. The second one is just an advertisement, but I found it right after I found the first card and I decided to junk journal with it. I find the levels of synchronicity here amazing. Same message and, you know, very relevant to me, by the way. And then I found it right after another. The other side has a story too. I found a two of spades in the water on the local beach. Just floating, you know, clearly it was meant for me to keep. Then, shortly after, I found another two of spades. This time with an image of a badger. This cute little but very, like, don't mess with it creature because it will mess you up. So I looked up symbolic meanings of both, the two spades and badger, just to keep things interesting, you know? Two of spades represent difficult decisions, weighting your options, avoidance. And badger, on the other hand, is about persistence, determination, endurance. And it teaches how to stick to a project and finish it. So, the universe has a great sense of humor and speaks this funny language, basically. And it is exactly why I'm recording this uh, video, because I have a lot of projects that I either need to finish or let go. It takes a lot of my mental energy to carry it around. Then there is the constant inner critic that reminds me of my chronic procrastination. Then I find another project to add to my list. The cycle is simply unhealthy and vicious. More themes I can draw from here are like accumulation, consumption, also and this perpetual saving for later syndrome that I'll probably talk in another videos. I had a great time junk journaling and was pleased that this theme just came about organically. Of course, the irony is that the more you do, the more ideas come along, but I'll leave that for next episode. Thank you so much for being here and I'll see you next time.